Good morning. Good morning, Dad. She took all of her stuff. Last night, I put a note right here. Aurora was above it. And Aurora took the note. <laughs> I brought a picture of her as good as I can. Did she, did she leave you something back? I don't see anything up there. Maybe she'll leave you something before well, Christmas. Where is the elf? Where is she? Oh, oh you're right. There she is. She can fall into the water. <laughs> Let's do the advent calendar before I forget, really. Snowman. Mm -hmm. Another snowman. <laughs> oh, my goodness. We're getting so close to Christmas! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Only two more, right, Mommy? Three, well, three more until Christmas Day, two Yay! more until Christmas Eve. That. Mommy, what are we having? Eggs and, and uh, do sausage. <laughs> I'm not feeling that great this morning. My throat is still, like, bothering me a lot, but... Anyway, I'm making eggs for all the girls are home from Christmas break today. Eggs, I'm careful, that's hot, Mama, that's hot. And I'm making um, some breakfast turkey sausage. Well, baby, today today is the 21st. You're not supposed to do yours yet, Mama. <laughs> so this is what we're going to have for breakfast, probably with some grapes. You say hi. Say hi. That's awesome. Where's your fork? Here, use your other hand. Use your other hand. <laughs> Hi. Hey, Dad. Try again. <laughs> Almost. Try again. Oh, you got a little piece. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's like, oh, forget it. My fingers work better. <laughs> oh, mama. Here, try again. Look, with this hand. Or try, okay, if you're going to use that hand, do like this. There you go. <laughs> Oh, you can try with the other hand. No? Okay. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, you want help? Say help, please. Put in your hand. Put in your hand. Mommy, help. Mommy, help. Here, here. There you go. Yes. <laughs> Yay! Put it in your mouth. Oh, I don't. <laughs> look, uh, look, this is what? Look. Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it! Get it, get it! There you go. There you go. Now get it, Mama. So I can get it. <laughs> She's like, this thing will make me mad. I'm knocked out. <laughs> Jumping around. Make me mad. <laughs> now you're happy. <laughs> no, the horse uh, has a button on, uh, on the back. It's hard to get this thing off. You're supposed to press it. Put batteries and then it. put the carrot in uh, this mountain. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh, and it doesn't? Oh, it doesn't. Oh, do you have a screwdriver? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Mama, what are you doing? 
trying to get this. This is a battery, so. Does it take batteries? Batteries? Ready? One, two, three, four. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You're supposed to, knock yeah, knock them out. You're supposed to crash. Then I think whoever doesn't crash into the other one wins. Maybe. Oh. Okay, let's see, let's see how this works. Does it eat? Yeah, yeah it eats candy castles. And when you show them where it comes out. <laughs> Don't lose the carrot. Yeah, I thought it pushed it out too. You have three carrots, right? So don't lose them. I mean, me and Maddie can't find the other yeah, carrots. Yeah, put them in there so they don't don't get lost. See them? That's how that's how you do it. Hey guys, good afternoon. I don't think I said face to face. Hey, I think I filmed a little bit while I was at home, but I don't know. It was kind of a chill morning. Uh, what did we do? Had breakfast. We all, I think I showed that. We had eggs and sausage patties. And then the girls, when Andres got home a little bit earlier than anticipated, Nin came over. I helped her order a computer for her to go pick up. Um, we were looking at like specs and stuff like that. So she went to go, or she came over so we could order that so she could go pick it up. And then she had ordered some stuff from Target online and she got gift cards and she didn't know how to use them. She's like, I sent them to my trash. I'm like, Nin, that's free money. Nin's my aunt, if you guys don't know that. I was like, that's free money. She had like $15, $20, you know, when you buy like so many household items or soaps or whatever, you get a gift card back from Target. She was like, nah, I, I just don't, I don't want to worry about it. I'm like, no, let me print them out for you. That's free money. So that's what I did. I printed them for her. Um, she played with the girls for a few minutes. Uh, the girls opened all their new toys. Matt, um, Autumn at first was kind of afraid of the chuckle ball, but she likes it, which I'm glad because I had a feeling she would like it. I remember last year, I think, maybe earlier last year. No, I think it was before Autumn was born because, yeah, so it was like early, like mid 2016. So Maddie was not even three yet. She wanted the chuckle ball from Toys R Us and I don't know what happened. We just didn't end up getting it for her for her birthday or for Christmas. And so I thought Autumn would like it at this age. So um, that was for their tops presents. And if you guys know, then I think some, some, most of you know, last year, if you watch my vlogs, Chester is a family friend. He was in tops, which is a weight loss support group uh, for my mom and my grandma and him and my grandma were really great friends and he plays he is like a mall santa every year and he always would get the kids gifts because he all his grandkids and stuff he doesn't he didn't have any great grandchildren before he passed away last year and all of his grandkids are older so he always would buy the kids not just ours but all the tops grandkids or whatever that he would buy them gifts and so his daughter Pam and his granddaughter Kyla continued I think I mentioned this a few vlogs back but they continued the tradition in his honor like I guess he left a little fund which is so generous and so crazy to me that he's has been very ill for many years and he left a fund to get the kids gifts like that's just insane to me god rest his soul like it just is so kind and thoughtful really that to even just think about that before you pass away it just crazy to me but so they continue that tradition in his honor and that's those are the gifts that I had got at Target that day for a really great deal actually because I was able to get all the kids more than the $50 that he had given per child because of those deals that he had given uh, or that Target had given the spend $100 and get $25 off of toys so it ended up working out great. Well, that's Nin. Hello? Okay, so I got sidetracked talking to Nin. <laughs> I don't remember exactly what I was talking about. I think I was talking about the gifts. So yeah, Autumn liked her chuckle ball. Maddie loved the horse. And it's funny, she actually, I told you that horse, the, there's a show or a movie surrounding it called Spirit. And 
they were watching it this morning so she was super excited to be able it eats carrots and things she was very excited however Emmy's gift was the hit and I'm so glad it wasn't the exact one she had on her Christmas list the one on her Christmas list was the ultimate garage or something this one is I don't even know what it's called because I don't buy Hot Wheels ever <laughs> that's not something that I actually don't think we have any cars in our house and so to get her that was a big thing that's the first like I say boy toy very loosely because I don't I think all toys are gender neutral if boys want to play with dolls girls want to play with you know nerf guns and stuff hey so be it but that was like the first boy toy we really have had in the house and they love it they love it the bad thing that i didn't realize i would have got batteries had i realized this it takes d batteries which are expensive and luckily we had the four d batteries that it needed but i'm hoping it lasts a long time because every time they use it for what its intended purpose is it's using the batteries so i'm hoping that the batteries last a little while because d batteries are quite expensive but they love their toys we didn't bring out um, Autumn's building blocks or anything yet. I think she's still probably a little too young for that. But again, I have things on her Christmas list that are a little too old for her because she, their birthdays are all in the fall. So she will have nine months before she even gets anything at all other than like stuff we buy her. You know, her birthday's not till September. So she has a long growth period there where she, her mind is going to get more mature and she's gonna have baby toys still so I don't mind having the like one and a half to 36 month type toys for her which is kind of what the waffle blocks are so she may not play with those anytime but for right now she was happy with the chocolate ball so that's what I left them doing Andres was there he was about to make them lunch I am headed to a Longhorn Steakhouse for uh, my mom's work luncheon and I brought a gift for, I only had to do one gift this time, and I um, actually repurposed a knitting book that I wasn't going to use that I know my old boss likes, so I'm happy about that, and I put a Christmas card in there, and um, like a foot scrub set that I had found at Walmart for a really great deal. So I got that for her, and I'm hoping nobody else is there that I was supposed to get a gift for, because I only brought one gift. And then I'm going to stop at the bank while I'm over here. And I wanted, I was going to pick up last year for Christmas, I got Andres a, I think it was last year for Christmas, a cologne set from Sephora where you can go buy your own cologne. You know, go, it comes with little mini samples and then you trade it in for a bigger cologne. And he never traded it in. So I'm going to Alamo Ranch area if there's a Sephora over there in JCPenney. No, I, I know there is, not if there is. But if I have a second after, I'm just not sure how long the luncheon's going to run and I wanna be able to get home in time to figure out something for dinner. So I may stop by there and get him the cologne. He gave me the certificate. But if I don't have time, we'll go this weekend because I wanna take the girls to take pictures with Santa this weekend. Since typically we take pictures with Chester, and that's our Santa picture. Like, I always count that as our Santa picture. Maddie took pictures with Santa at school yesterday, but the other girls haven't taken pictures with Santa. So, I want to go to the mall. Plus, I need to get an ornament from the mall as well. So, we may, I may just wait till this weekend. I don't know. I'm in a better mood today, as you can tell. I feel a lot better. You know, just in general, I, I just feel better about how everything ended yesterday. I'm not feeling great in my in my chest though. Like I have I had some sort of buildup or something. I keep coughing. It keeps making my voice go in and out, and I feel just like a tightening here. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I thought I was getting sick, and then I thought it was going away, and now I feel like all kind of gross. I don't know. So hopefully it continues to go away because I hate coughing at the hospital because it makes me even if I'm not sick, like if it's allergies or something, it makes me sound sick and I don't, the hospital is like the worst place to be sick, even though sick people go there because you don't want to infect anybody else, you know? And nobody ever believes that it's allergies. Like the other day when I was all stuffy, 
if I had been like that around somebody, they had been like, oh, get away from me, you're sick. And I'd be like, oh no, it's allergies. Really, it's allergies. I mean, you see it cleared up the next day, but nobody believes that, you know? So, anyway, almost to the restaurant. I'm not a huge fan of Longhorn Steakhouse either because I, I, I don't really like steak, so I'll probably have to find some chicken or shrimp or something, but it's a free luncheon. Not gonna complain, you know? No, it's just one number today. It's your turn. Oh, wait. It's not your turn. Hold on, hold on. Let me it think. Is. Is it, mommy? it is, Mommy. Today? You did it this morning? Oh my gosh, all my days are running together. No, baby, tomorrow. That's tomorrow. Oh. We'll do it tomorrow morning, okay? Tomorrow you'll do 22. Lord, I'm losing it. So, hi guys. Autumn and Mommy, we're going to do this song's counter. Okay. Okay. Adam, Mama, today is the, is the ninth. You got to pick it up so that they can clearly see it. See how it's all blurry? Yeah. There you go. Leave it like that. Okay, Adam. Push it. Oh, not there. There we go. Okay, on top of all the other ones, huh? Oh, no. You got three of them. <laughs> All right, now 17. Put it down. Okay, right there. It's almost Christmas. No, 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 don't push that. It's almost Christmas, sorry, Mommy. Almost Christmas. Either way. I'm excited. There you go, good job. And then we're going to see Santa on the fire truck, 19. right? 19. Good girl. Turn it around. <laughs> She's like, why is it sticking, eh, Mommy? Here, like this. Good job. Good job, Mama. Mommy's too blurry. Oh, my God. Put it. Did you put it? Good job. Now 21. Now 21. It's almost Christmas. Uh oh, put it's it in. Hey, mommy. Great job, Adam. Yay! Can I turn it off? Yes. Plus, this the really small one. Yes. I'm opening up all the little um, bags and stuff we got from the holiday party last night. And <laughs> the girls didn't see all of it. And then I also have like a little Autumn, get over here, baby. I also have a little candy dish that's been sitting on Maddie, which one do you want? Um, the table. This is Autumn's mommy. Yeah, that's fine. That's one I've given her last night. And so I'm just adding all the little candies in there for anyone to have during, you know, holiday parties and stuff. Um, and then I also, the all the bagged candy that I had, this is all I have left that the Hershey's from giving them out to the teachers and different things. Cool, huh? Mm -hmm. Yes, mommy. Can we give this to Autumn? Mommy, can, can I keep this? Not, not when she's walking, just in case can, she falls. Can I, can I keep this? Yeah. <laughs> Yay! And, and then, and then maybe so cool, the one does the best after, after this, and this I can do it. And this is Yay! a princess. Excuse me, ma'am. What are you doing? Shut that. Thank you. I was in the middle of editing and we heard Santa again and this time he is supposed to come through right through our neighborhood our street so we are not going to miss him and it's not that late it's 7 19 so the girls weren't even they were waiting for Santa to come you ready yeah you excited yes yes yes, yes. <laughs> the nine, I think he's coming what Santa? If he's coming that way, no way that Well, no, and then we've only <laughs> seen him the last like three years. Yeah, and then he's on the biotech, like on the back. <laughs> okay, so false alarm on Santa. He's kind of in the neighborhood, kind of not. <laughs> I don't know. It's like we heard him, we saw on the neighborhood app that he was here, but. We were waiting outside and I told on the bus, I was like, I have a really long vlog. The vlog was almost 40 minutes last night, uh, or for tonight's vlog. And I was like, I have a really long vlog, so I'm going to go back in and continue to edit. And you just call me whenever Santa's here and I'll come running down. 
So he said, okay. Well, then all of a sudden I hear the girls inside and I guess he, they hadn't come or Santa hadn't come and so he would rather have them in here than out there. That way they could watch TV or whatever. So I went upstairs to finish editing. It is 8.30 and still no Santa. So the girls are watching a Barbie show because they've been super into Barbies lately. And I am putting box tops on because you guys are amazing and have sent me so many of them. So I am, that's what I'm doing currently cutting and pasting box tops onto these sheets so they can be dropped off after the new year and more than likely i got i have four sheets here so more than likely they will be full by the time school starts again so yeah that is what has been our night autumn's already asleep she's been asleep for a while she's been going to bed super early just you know over the sickness and stuff although she's doing a hundred percent better i mean she looks amazing compared to what she looked like before she's eating everything we give her drinking everything we give her which is awesome i can tell she's starting to get back to her old self so that makes me so happy for dinner tonight because after i didn't end a new vlog after the party um i was at the party till like almost 3 30 came home I was like, I was so tired, I almost couldn't keep my eyes open. We all kind of had a relaxing afternoon, you know, late afternoon. I sat on the couch and I dozed off for like an hour, which is gonna be awful tonight since I work tomorrow because I'm probably not gonna be able to go to bed on time. So that stinks, but I'll make it work. And the girls played with their toys. We watched TV and we did cereal for dinner tonight. Easy peasy lemon squeezy because it was just not a night that i felt like cooking we had lots of cereal and it's funny we almost go through an entire like small box not the family box like a regular size box we almost go through an entire box when we all have cereal and like half a gallon of milk it's crazy so that's what we did for dinner i'll have to make a meal plan for the rest of the weekend except for Christmas Eve, we're doing like potluck and stuff. So that's what we're doing. Waiting around for Santa to make an appearance. Highly disappointed. Santa never came. And according to the fire department's website, today was the last day. And apparently they had our neighborhood on there and they took it off. I don't know because on our neighborhood app they said that they went down like one of the main roads of our neighborhood but they didn't go inside any of the neighborhood and they totally skipped the neighborhood next to us so the girls I felt so bad because the girl Maddie started crying like they were absolutely devastated Santa did not come because we hyped him up we were like oh Santa's coming which how are we supposed to know like that's very devastating to children I, I don't understand how they could say that they're coming one day and put it on the schedule and then they don't come. That's, I mean, come on. It's Christmas. You can't not show up, Santa. So, anyway, we spent the majority of our night. My and Vinny was waiting outside for a very long time. Waiting. The girls ended up coming in and watching Barbie when I was doing the box tops. And I ended up finishing up the vlog and everything. But it was just, they were very upset, very upset. So... We had to get past that, get ready for bed, and now I am getting ready for bed. It's 9.30. You guys know my goal is to be asleep by 10. That's probably not going to happen, considering I am not tired at all. At all. I'll probably just lay here and try and fall asleep, but I am not tired at all. So, that's what I get for taking an hour nap on the couch and I knew that was going to happen and I just kept telling myself when I as I was falling asleep I was like don't do it don't do it get up do something because if you get up and do something then you'll be exhausted tonight and you'll fall asleep nope I let myself fall asleep and everyone else let me fall asleep too <laughs> so it was like what are you gonna do <clears throat> hopefully if I don't go to bed until closer to 11 because I got that extra hour I won't feel so crummy in the morning and even if I do, I have a week in between shifts, so I, I won't die. I guess I'll be fine. I've gone with less sleep to a 12-hour shift before. So, 
what else? I finished up a bunch of Christmas cards to you guys. I finished um, doing, I didn't, okay, I didn't finish. I was doing a bunch of Christmas cards to you guys, bundling them up, writing addresses and stuff on them. I need to drop them off at the post office this weekend. So you guys are going to be getting Christmas cards after Christmas. I apologize. It's just kind of the way that the week worked out. I still have many more Christmas cards to go pick up from the P.O. box. I figure as long as you get them between Christmas and New Year, I think it'll be okay. I don't know. I also was writing out thank you letters for those of you that had sent box tops or like sent birthday cards, little things like that. I've been trying to catch up with all of my mail that you guys send me to write back. Um, it's just taking me a little while. So what I have been doing the last few nights is while I'm editing, typically I'll multitask, I'll edit. And especially because like this, I have long stretches of periods in most of my vlogs where I do nothing but talk. So I can listen, I don't have to watch for anything. I can listen to it and I'll write out like a quick thank you note. And I usually can get two to three done in a video. That's what happened yesterday and today. And I did my Christmas cards as well. So that was pretty productive. So be expecting notes from me back or little cards from me back and Christmas cards if you've sent me something. And I'll have to check my P.O. box probably not tomorrow, maybe Saturday. And then the, everything else will go out next week. So yeah. It wasn't a super productive day, but I got through it, and now I'm headed to bed because tomorrow I have a very long work day. So I hope you guys enjoyed. We will see you at 5 a.m. Bye!